All right, so here we are. So if you watched our last stream, if you've seen anything about the game so far, we've shown this off before, but we're going to do some cool stuff with it. We're going to show you something that you might not have seen, as well as maybe walk you through some of the upgrades that are available for Sebastian. So let's take a, a look. A wheelchair and a light. What could this be? Oh, have a seat. Back again or something? What? Oh. hey -o. Familiar faces, everyone. Mm-hmm. All right, so let's take a look at some of our upgrades. So uh, in the Evil Within 2, you'll be able to upgrade and customize your Sebastian just like you were able to do in the first game, but we've added a lot more um, skills and abilities, so we've expanded the trees. One of the things that's really cool, too, that we'll show in a second is we've actually broken out those um, gel from weapon parts, so it allows you to really choose um, if you want to customize Sebastian himself or the gear that you're using. So let's take a look. How do you like to play when you play the Evil Within? Uh, Combat, health, health, and health. stamina are my favorites. All right, so let's see, we got like increased max health. Oops, I'm flicking around too fast. Uh, we have vitality, so total health recovery. We have, if you attack, uh, barely do enough damage, you get away with the skin of your teeth, so it's kind of like a, a free pass. So let's, let's upgrade our health. Just like any other game that has a tree like this, we gotta go along the tree, so let's do two. And everything's just like a little bit, right? Like, they're never gonna be able to have enough to like yeah. completely beast out your Sebastian. Right, and that's also really important to know too, the game will have a new game plus. Um, so some of the abilities are really, really expensive, but they're really, really good. Like, let's take a look at this one. What's that one? Yeah, press Y while aiming to concentrate and slow down time. Pressing Y again to end the effect. So you get to slow down time, really aim up your shots. Super, super expensive. That 75. one's only 75,000, yeah, exactly. not counting all the lead up to that right. you have to have. Exactly. So uh, let's put this in here. So steady hand, reduce reticle sway when we're firing. All right, let's see what else we got in here. I like to put in recovery too. It is a survival horror game, right? Mm -hmm. So we're gonna have to use some recovery items. So to your point before, we're jumping up 10%, 100 to 100, yeah. 110. Very minimal. Very minimal. All right, let's see what else. I think that's pretty good does here. This, does the new game have brass knuckles? Brass knuckles? <laughs> like as a weapon? Uh, no, <laughs> uh, I don't think we're going to talk about just yet what it actually does unlock, but I can mm -hmm. tell you there's some really cool stuff that when you play through again, that you'll get to change your gameplay a little bit in terms of, uh, I'd say, not so much gameplay as your look of Sebastian and look Only of the game. Only a week to wait to find out. I know. All right, so I put in Endurance too. All right, so this was this is Sebastian himself. Let's stand up and let's go do weapons and let's have the chat pick out some of the weapons we want to upgrade. So let's see. You hear the cat? All right, that was really in sync. Yeah. We All right, so weapons upgrades, and crafting. So in this part of the game, we only have a handgun, we have a shotgun, we have a sniper rifle, and a warden crossbow. Uh, there's more weapons to get, but this is just what we have in this save file. So let's see. Do we want to let chat? What does chat think we should upgrade? Upgrade our handgun, shotgun. Sniper rifle, warden oh, I crossbow. I love sniper rifles. I feel like the crossbow is like the best bet to have just because it's kind of like across the board, like the iconic weapon for yeah. Sebastian. But I see crossbow, yeah, crossbow, cross shotgun, crossbow, crossbow. All right, let's shotgun see crossbow. Shotgun is also good. Yeah. All right, so let's see what we can do in here. We can do range, charge time, harpoon bolts, explosive bolts. So we'll go through some of the bolts too when we, when we I almost said what actually comes after this on accident because we're leaving that for a surprise. But we'll actually go through some of those bolts uh, uh, when we go here. So let's just at least go with range so we can obviously shoot a little bit further. That's uh, always helpful. Yeah, it's always helpful. You can helpful. basically make your crossbow into a sniper rifle. Same with charge time. To reduce the amount of time it takes to charge up. What was the other big one? Was it shotgun? Yeah. Shotgun, shotgun, shotgun. Okay. Handgun's pretty good too. I see a couple handguns. Well, let's go with this. This gun is super, super slow to, uh, to fire and reload because it is a shotgun. So let's, let's do that. Which one should we do, chat? Reload time or fire rate? Let's do, ready? What? I got an idea. What are we doing? Let's do an emote vote. <laughs> you love the emote I vote. love the emote <laughs> votes. All right, let's do this, ready? For reload time, cats. For fire rate, dogs. I feel like people like cats on the internet more than they like well, dogs. Let's find out. <laughs> cats. Uh and fire it. Hey, Jigsaw you Killer, just, we recognize your name. How's it going? Just pick ammo capacity just to mess with them. There's a dog. So we got our first one for fire rate, fire oh, rate. There's a couple cats. Cats, 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 cats. That's I, a lot of I cats. I think cats might actually win, like yeah. you said. Cats. I don't know. It's yeah, pretty equal. I, think, I guess it's up to you, AJ. I feel like I still feel like cats equal, are winning in a Equal slide. pet opportunists here. <laughs> there's some mice. Uh, what is that? Fire rate then? It doesn't count. No. All right, let's go with reload speed. Right, we've reloaded. Let's see what else. Um, do I do firepower? Let's, 
Let's do one in firepower for our handgun because I think that's pretty good. And since we got a couple dogs, we'll uh, we'll we'll go with firepower in our handgun. Oh, you're that? just so nice. I know, right? Too nice. You're really helping them out. I know. All right, what else we want to do? Is that good here? Yeah. We don't have a lot more weapon parts. So crafting, so you can actually craft. Uh, that is a ton of things. That's a ton of things. You can craft weapons. I'm sorry, not weapons. What am I talking about? You can craft weapon ammo, crossbolts, and health recovery. Uh, a cool thing about this game as well is you are actually able to do this on the fly if you want to. But there's the penalty of the fact that you pay a little bit more for the actual uh, resources. So use it as a last resort. Definitely yeah. not something you want to do all the time. It's nice in a pinch. Nice in a pinch. There's a lot of pinches. Yeah. So we don't have to craft anything here. We saw, Actually, we'll craft, a shock, we'll craft some shotgun bullets. There we go. Uh, let's see. All this and how other easy stuff. is it to find like weapons, parts, and things that you need for crafting? So one of the nice parts about the game is uh, there are a lot of more open areas that allow you to take a breath from uh, just going through the horrors that you'll find in the world. So mm -hmm. when you go out and you explore, that's one of the things you'll find is you'll find a lot cool. more uh, crafting components, a lot more health recovery items. So taking that breath is kind of good because you get to see more of the world, get some collectibles, get some items, find out what's going on, and uh, it, it's a good way to just take a break. You know what else is a good way to take a break? Shooting range. The shooting range. What? A shooting range? It's a nice way to at least get your practice on. A shooting range? What is this? What is this? So, uh, two modes. We have gallery mode, which just, uh, allows us to uh, go through and shoot stuff. There are rewards for doing this. Uh, you can see you get weapon parts, herbs, green gel, if you uh, do get high scores, which is pretty cool. And then there's also chain attack mode. Chain attack mode is a little bit harder. It's kind of like a, a weird game of Tetris. Which one should we play real quick? Uh, do that one. This one? Yes. Okay. I like the border. It's like on your phone. God, right. that's satisfying. Oops, I screwed up. Why is it wiggly? You know what's also hard is that, ah. Uh, oh, they booed you. I know, right? <laughs> it's hard because I'm also used to playing on a keyboard and mouse, but hey, we're doing pretty good. Can Seb tell dad jokes? Uh, actually, you know what's funny? is in this mode, there's probably two really good Easter eggs that I don't want to tell you about, where Seb does say some pretty funny stuff. Oh. <laughs> we'll keep that for you next Boom! Time. Well done. Right? Well done. Let's see. Maybe I lost my edge. Oh, was that like, was he insulting your skills? Yeah, I think so. I think so. <laughs> womp womp. Uh, I really was hoping he does one of the, I don't, again, I don't want to spoil what it is, but hey. Let's get to the game. Outside. Can I? Go outside. <laughs> Can Solid Age please stand up as he's the real Slim Shady? Take it, you know this person. I do, it's my buddy Chris. <laughs> Hi, Chris. All right. So we want to play the game? Yeah. Really? I mean, you're playing the game, Hold but... on, before we play the game, should we actually give something away? Oh, sure. We will give away this beautiful red that you can't see because it's dark. Evil Within Tea. It is a size medium, <gasps> so... What's this? And also... Are you giving a comic away too? I thought they go together. No, it goes with the cat. Well, I have a comics at my desk, so I will. I All right. Will... Well, AJ will supply you with comics as well. Yeah. Sorry, that's my bad. <laughs> I, I don't pay attention. We have comics and shirts together. We'll just give away five comics. It's no problem. Yeah, I don't care. Or six. We'll give away six comics. Okay. Okay. Let's do it. Do it. Let's give it away. So this is a size medium. Um, if you can't fit into a medium for whatever reason, we can you can cut the front of it off and put it on a canvas. You can't cut that's an exclusive shirt. You can't get that anywhere. You can still cut the cover off if if you can't wear it. No. Fine, whatever. <laughs> you technically Let you want to do, what do they whatever want the hell with you their want shirt. With it. Yeah. Uh so do we have a winner yet, Nicole? All right, we're waiting for someone to follow, follow and I'm going to read the comic instead. That's not you're not reading it out loud. We'll just go back, go, take oh. the fashion run around. <laughs> I'm glad that you got engaged into your comic. It's a comic. Are you kicking doors now? Mm -mm 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 -mm. We, should we wait by the cat? No? Oh, 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 oh. We got something All right, let's show. just go. Uh, that's also Gary that's doing Gary's stuff We have stuff a winner. Congratulations to Ninja Gamer 222. Ninja Gamer, big shout out. Hopefully you're a size medium or smaller or slightly larger that fits into a medium and that you can read comics because they're fun. <laughs> Hope you can read comics. <laughs> you know, Friday. Um, have you seen the ad that's out right now that uses this music? 
Claire yes, de Lune? Yes, I did. Isn't yeah. there, I, 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 I actually, came within. I did a double take. There's an actual ad that's that's running right now. I see it all the time on YouTube, I think. And I was like, wait, what? We don't have an ad running with Claire de Lune. Um, yeah, it's not even for a video game. Uh, okay, so what was it last week? National Coffee Day? Yeah. I don't know. I don't drink coffee. Shame on you. I, I don't like coffee. Then you'll never survive. The horrors within. <laughs> the horrors within. So let's drink some coffee. We don't really need to here, but we'll at least show off what it is. So this is actually a pretty cool mechanic that over time you brew a cup of coffee. It'll take your health all the way um, from wherever it is to full. Sebastian and it's, slugs it's got down a that very coffee. satisfying animation. I'm usually like, ugh. Oh. You I might, love coffee. You may be able to find those union mugs on our uh, oh. store pretty soon. A little spoiler. Who doesn't want to pretend they're in a nightmare town? I know I do. Every day. There were so many Nightmare Before Christmas jokes just went through my head <laughs> and I just didn't say any of them. You're on a roll. I am on a roll. I listened to that soundtrack on the way home yesterday because it's so good. It's Halloween, man. we got to get in the spirit. And we have more treats. Speaking of Halloween, five more prizes to win. So... Just be following our channel and be in the chat and don't be a robot. And if you are a robot, I'm not trying to discriminate against robots. I love robots, but this it's is not a robot help free you, zone. Like getting messages across. This All must right. be City Hall. Gotta stop this guy and save Lily. Like the gazebo. You're spoiling it. Just look at it, I can see it. Uh, how long is the stream? About an hour. A little bit on our stop, so five hours. Do we want to talk about who that was, or do we just want to let it go? Like, uh, we're gonna see him in a second. What the fuck is that? Does it say who he is? I don't think so, actually. What's that? All right. So one thing I'll point out is in the top left corner, you see that little heartbeat monitor, right? It's actually um, telling us that there's a resonance point around here, so. We talked about this last time, but it's worth going into. One of the things, because the game is a little more open now, is there's a lot of cool points of interest. So you'll be guided there uh, through your resonator. So this actually allows me to look around. I can see that, hey, this is in the general area. I'm going to lock on to it. Uh, this allows me to find out what's going on in the world. They're kind of like echoes. So we're going to just tap into this, hear a little bit about what happened. I know, so uh, we got some memories that are unlocked, so you need those for collectibles. There's a lot of collectibles in the game, and a also you get, some, you get some gel as well. Um, can we turn up the volume a little bit for the game? Uh, I'm going to make sure to that. Okay, I just wanted to make sure there wasn't a, uh, the, the voices were turned down. So, to what AJ just did, there are a lot of customizations available in the options for the game that lets you play around. Oh, do you want to see that? We could do a quick scan through. We don't want to get into the, all the details, but we did just release our system specs yep. on Bethesda.net where you can see the PC's minimum and recommended specs and the yep. advanced settings are on there. Console information is on there as well. So. Yeah, and I will say this from the team at Tango. They've taken a lot of time to uh, refine the stuff specific, the settings specifically for the PC game. They understand there were opportunities when the first game came out, so there's a lot in here in terms of being able to customize mm -hmm. your experience to make it uh, really what you want to um, uh, what your system can handle, so definitely take a look in there, but uh, they are way more um, fleshed out than the first time around. Mm -hmm. So we have our graphic settings, obviously audio settings, simple control settings in terms of cover, sprint, nothing crazy here. You want it to be dark and loud dark. and scary. Uh, I will see a lot of people that were actually surprised about the field of view, so that is in there. Mm -hmm. That's actually something uh, people really, really were excited about when they played it at PAX. Uh, so yeah. All right, so you said where can they find that? Bethesda.net? Bethesda.net. Yep, we just put it up today. All right, so let's get going. Let's play. Let's see what horrors await us outside this gate. Tentacle leg things. Somebody ask if you can choose to have a black horse? Yeah, just you wait, asshole. Uh, if they can actually put them on? Mm -hmm. Yep. Happening. Mm. 
Mm, that's probably not good. Ross is playing us at midnight on Friday. Hell yeah. Me. Me. You found a new friend. I did move. Oh, I got excited. I looked at chat. <laughs> <laughs> oh boy. All right. I can ignore that. All right. Well, she sees you. She sees me. That's yeah, that's because that we was. loaded up the, the the safe specifically, so it wasn't uh, last time. All right, so I'm gonna use some environmental stuff to help me. Whoops! It would help if I actually equipped my gun, right? <laughs> I don't think I'd want to take her on in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Come on. Oh yeah. Ooh. So there's a lot of traps and things uh, throughout a lot of the game. I would uh, totally just run right into that and died. I've done this a couple times though. So you gotta really use your environment. Come on. Come over mad. here. You mad, bro? We're gonna use our upgraded shotgun the chat. This upgrade. Oh. One. Well, time uh -oh. is still slowed down. Again, it's shooting slowly because time is slow right now. It's too loud to run. Oh, look at her little dangly head. It's so gross. All right, now that I'm reloading, I should probably run. So yeah. So you'll soon find out that one of the things about this area and Stefano in general, the guy you're chasing throughout here is the ability to stop time, use his camera to stop time, so. Uh-oh. What is sticking out of her back? Is that like spikes or something? Oh, I did not want to jump up there. <laughs> Let's see what else we got over here. Oh, I oh, ran no. too long. I ran too long. <laughs> That's a mistake. <laughs> no, don't hit me. All right, let's see what else we got for some environmental things. I gotta get my stamina back up. So it is a survival horror line, game, right? Oh, we did upgrade our stuff. We upgrade our stamina, but being survival horror, like this is not a. You're not an Olympic athlete. Yeah. <laughs> He's an old alcoholic. Leave him alone. <laughs> Literally an old alcoholic. Let's go back to the shotgun. Oh. All right, so I'm running low on bullets, so I'm actually going to show what we talked about here. So I'm going to open up my radial menu, which has everything from my weapons to my health syringe, and I'm actually going to select uh, field crafting. And it does stop time so that you can take a moment yep. to catch your breath. does stop time. Uh, so if you notice, too, the cost actually went up almost doubled from when we were making them at our workbench. Great. So again, I'm kind of using this in the pinch to show off you to you guys. You scrappy, but though, so yeah. sometimes that costs more. So I'm literally going to be able to make one bullet. Thanks, Bethesda. <laughs> All right. But there's a lot to find. That didn't even phase her. No. Come on, Sebastian. Let's go. Get to that oil. Let's see what we got here. So here's some more stuff we can pick up. Here's At least you parts. brought that box for you. She made it easy for you. Oh, oh God. Oh. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. <laughs> well. Oh, I killed her. <laughs> what? <laughs> I thought she was going to kill me. <laughs> that was... <laughs> that, was, that was very <laughs> risky. I thought the game had like crashed or something, but uh, no, I actually killed her. Okay, I killed her in the middle of the animation. Get her goopies. Yeah, that's a lot of that's a lot of gel. Wow. <laughs> that moment where you're having a heart attack and then you don't I know, know like, whether to come happened? down from the heart attack oh, okay. or just stay with it. I uh, hope the hardest difficulty is still on here. Uh, as we mentioned before, not only is the hardest difficulty on here from the first game, it's even harder this time with limited saves. So have fun. Yeah. Good luck. Good luck. Good luck. Uh, I'm just going to run around here, see if I can find anything else. And then we're going to go inside. And I hope you kids are strapped in for what's inside. That's all I'm saying. Strapped in a stem. If you've not already turned off your lights and turned up the music, you should probably do that. Just saying. It's spooky, y'all. Before we go in here, since we won, should we do another giveaway? Yeah. All right, let's do it. Next giveaway, our last shirt. This is an extra large. And a comic, since AJ has promised more comics. <laughs> On accident, but I will, <laughs> I, 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 will, I will make good. Why not? So, if you want to purchase issue one, it is available from Titan Comics, both physical and digital. You yep. can get it from your local comic or bookstore. You can get it online at places like Amazon, I think. It's gotten really good reviews online. The art's amazing. It's if you like comics. really cool. If you, even if you're not a huge comic fan, but you There's like some, Evil like, Within the Lore. alternative covers it's that really are good. like really gross and amazing. Congratulations to Big Stub Brown, or Big, Big Stub. Big, Big Stub Big Brown. Stu Brown. <laughs> Big Sorry about Stub that. Brown. We, 
<laughs> There's not two bees there. We'll contact you after this stream is over because I can't do it from here. But we'll get your information. So got the first comic today. For that message. Hope you like the first comic. Yeah. There's a question about read. the cat. What, do we have any other questions? I missed one. I don't know. We have three cats and three comics with the cats to give away. All right. And then Xbox One S, which I guess will also come with a comic. All right, so for this part, uh, like I mentioned before and like Jess mentioned, uh, there's going to be some spoilers. Um, we definitely want you to tune in and take a look at those. Um, if you've watched watch some, our spoilers. Yeah, watch our spoilers. <laughs> but uh, also, we're going to probably try to talk a little bit less, but there will be questions in the chat, and we definitely want to answer them for you guys because we know you're here to uh, get some questions to the game because it comes out really soon. But uh, let's get right into it. Oh, he's alive. I was like, oh, he's moving. <laughs> Who's there? It's okay. Harrison, right? I'm not one of them. Uh, who are you? Don't worry. O'Neill sent me. I... I thought I was the only one left. I'm looking for the core. Where is she? Is she here? S second floor. The stable field emitter. Emitter? Forget about that. I'm here to find the core. You must turn on the emitter. It will stabilize the environment. Without it, Union will completely collapse. Then the core won't matter. Turn it on. It will affect his power. His power? You mean? Take this. Use it to turn on the emitter. All right, so since we did jump into this, I'll give a little bit of context. Um, we mentioned before that you thought your daughter was dead. Mm -hmm. um, she's not dead. Lily is the name of your daughter. She's actually the one that's powering this entire world that you're in. So when he refers to the core, that is Lily. He's looking for his daughter who's powering this world that they happen to be in. So he's... And everything's going crazy. Woo and you are not alone in this world. You have plenty of friends. Plenty of friends. Some of them are worse for wear, though. Poor Harrison. Some of them will give you objectives and things to help them with. Some of them might fight alongside of you. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of people to, to interact with. I love the attention to detail where like all the signs have like names and stuff with them. Well, this is interesting. That's his M.O. He's somewhere in here. Yeah, just, just what you mentioned before, the attention to detail, like I could walk around here yeah. and see something new every single time. The interior decorator here is on point. What's this about? It is beautiful. I like that dress. So the theme of the area we're in inside of uh, the city hall is photography, right? That's what yeah. Stefano is, uh, has done in the past before he was inside this world. There's a really cool trailer you should go take a look at that mm -hmm. kind of goes over who Stefano is and what he's done. So Let's you get to know our photo boy. What do we do here? What do, what do we think we do? What's this? <clears throat> he wants to know this as well. This camera's so old. I know. Puzzles? Puzzles? This People think it's something. a puzzle? Oh. Maybe it is a puzzle. Maybe it's a puzzle. Let's see what we got here. Here's your oh. here's your entry to knowing what the first result of the puzzle is. I know, right? That's what we meant. It's one of the things we were kind of hinting at when we said, hey, there'll be spoilers mm -hmm. ahead, but all right, so let's place our flowers. You get one solution.
right, that looks pretty good to me. And in case you haven't been able to connect the pieces together, it has to look like what was in that picture. Right there. That picture? Oh, I'm so <laughs> Don't oh shoot! God. That picture, it moved. Actually, you know what? Line uh, up. It's not going to work. It's not? Nothing. No. Oh, did you not spin it right? What am I yeah. missing? I just noticed that. Yeah, people are saying spoilers, spoilers. We literally warned you twice at the beginning of the stream and right before we came into this. But if you're joining now, spoilers. Spoilers. We're showing off this part of the game because it's really, really awesome, but yeah. of course there's going to be spoilers. There's still plenty of other things to yes. know. There's not a lot of heavy story spoiling in here. It's just more of experience yes. spoiling. All right. Does that look good? I think so. She's got no face or arms, though. Neither does the... Oh, she has arms. She has no face. Did I just look at you? Oh. Hey! Well, that's weird. That wasn't there before. And it's gone. You uh, know. There's going to be a lot of that. Just like, just like any creepy old city hall. Everybody wants Sebastian to wear the dress. That's not the part dress? of the puzzle. Oh. All right, so what do we got to do here? Appreciate the art. He just told you. Oh. Fine. As long as it gets me closer to you, I'll play your game. All right. So let's appreciate some art. Oh. That's uh, that's art. This stuff. What is that one? Uh, I don't know. It's like a head coming off of a body, or I think I think that was a necklace. This one oh, yeah. is pretty good. I, that, that might be my second lady. favorite. Yeah. Creepy. Bloody rose. Is the rose red, or is it red with blood? Oh. Tango comes up with this stuff. That's different. What is that one? That's Lily. <laughs> Someone said in chat says, don't do drugs, kid. <laughs> oh, that's a problem. Well then. Welcoming. This seems perfectly fine. Yeah, so as I mentioned before too, like I think that this game is like if you played the first game as well, you'll know that there was an amazing sound design by the guys at Tango. I think this game takes it to an entirely new level. So mm -hmm. when you, you get it and you uh, you sit down on Friday the thirteenth, put on a nice pair of headphones, crank up your audio system, turn off the lights, and really experience it. Perfect experience so for good. the month of October and beyond. Happy Halloween. Let's give away a kitty and a comic. Not true, so it is my work after all. The death preserved on its silver white trait. Like a fly in amber. Beautiful. Beautiful. <coughs> uh you know what I'm gonna say, right? What? can't just give away a cat. Yeah, we can. Without something happening we in chat. We only told people. Without something happening in chat. Oh, you want the cat. <laughs> Everybody, flood your cat emojis. And we will pick a winner for the cat and the comic. I'm just going to read this while you explore things. OK. Is that enough cats, AJ? I think that's good. All right, do we have our winner? And the winner is? Duggan Astrology. Congratulations. I hope I pronounced your name it's correctly. It's actually an awesome name. I like it. You will be receiving a save kitty and a comic book. Contact you after the stream. Let's continue through our nightmare. 
Now where are you? I look away for a second. It looks like the floor for the shining carpet. Just different colored. Yeah. So we're still trying to track down this lunatic. We don't know who he is yet inside the game. We've seen him a couple times. Mm -hmm. We know that we're trying to find our daughter. She's here. She's the core. And we were sent here by um, some friends that we mentioned before. There's multiple people inside of this world that have sent us on this mission to one. try to uh, stabilize it. But what's he after? What is he after? Oh, more dresses. Why? Uh, those what? definitely had heads about 30 seconds ago. Great. That's not ominous at all. I know, right? There's so many things in this game that, are, like we said, small details that really mess with your mind. So good. And there was definitely a hallway here before. Sebastian's House of Horrors. Uh, I've seen a couple times too. Is this a demo? No, this is this is a pre-build of the game that we used uh, for um, some press. So this is not a public available demo. That's why we're playing it here for you guys on the stream. What is that? The gentleman we've been looking for. <laughs> not too easy. Also not there before. Super creepy. Oh, and then the floor is gone. And the floor is gone. Smile for the camera. Super creepy. Are those like real people? Uh, were they alive at one point? I don't know. You might have to play the game. Maybe, maybe some hints as to what they actually are. Look at the detail. It looks so good. Ooh, their heads are bubbling. You guys can't see it in the stream right now, but Nicole's closing her eyes. She's so scared. <laughs> so scared. Can you hit them? Can you shoot them? Uh, I, can, I can do that. Ooh. Actually, can I shoot them? That's a great question. Are they making blood yeah, mist? I can shoot them. Oh, oh no. Okay. <laughs> I have actually never done that before. <laughs> well then. first, folks. Sebastian was the enemy all along. <laughs> Poor goopy people. Love to see some concept art for the game. Um, the, we did announce a strategy guide that's coming out. It's a really nice hardcover strategy guide. And I don't know if we've announced it previously, but whatever. I'll do it right now. Taking it live. Taking it live. <laughs> There'll be some great concept art inside that guide. So definitely pick it up when it comes out on uh, Friday the 13th. The guide comes out the same day as the game? Yes. Cool. And it'll have some awesome art in it. Gonna get that. Quite a few pages dedicated to it. Well. Light bulbs. I'd be interested in a map of this building as it evolves. Yeah. Like house of rotating doors. Uh, collector's edition. There is no collector's edition or special edition. It's one version of the game. This has to be the emitter. Let's give away another cat. Before we turn on the emitter? Before we turn on the emitter. Okay, good, because I need a breather. <laughs> Things are getting too real for you, yeah. AJ. Another cat and comic. Flood, let the cat emojis fly. Go kitties. Go kitties, go kitties. There they go. Oh, the cat, what? I don't know what that that's one was. That's a dead mom. Was. Yeah, that's not a cat. That's a cat. That's a- um, Those are dogs. That you was guys a siren. are defiant. It's a siren, more cats. That's a cat, a cat. That's a cat, that's a cat. Cat, cat, cat. That's a raccoon. And the winner oh, is. That's a cool username too. Cardio Arum. That is cool. Cardio. Congratulations, you've won a save kitty. 
which uh, somebody asked before if we're going to sell the cats. So I could get like a shadow play going here. The cats are a cool promotional thing again. We're not going to be selling. So Ooh. that's why I got to tune in, man, and get these awesome things. We got a shirt and got a cat that you can't get anywhere else. Or this. Right? Right. Can't get this anywhere else. For those of you that are just joining you us, could, we will be giving away a console at the end of the stream. You could win more of you them. You could but win more of them throughout the before the game's out, but as far as the stream goes. You're going to have to get that last guy up there before it's over. He's okay. like way up high. I can get that. Audio is crackling a bit. That's actually the game. Yes. <laughs> There's actually audio oh, static yet. Yeah, okay. <laughs> it's going. <laughs> yeah, that is the game. Terminal. Intentionally, the game. Restart sequence initiated. It's a perfect moment of what's this? Yeah, the audio. The audio should no longer be crackly. Let us know if it is in chat, and we'll uh, we'll see if it's us. That thing's kind of crackling. Yeah, it is, but you're going to get some dialogue here now. Let's find out who this bad guy is that we've been chasing this whole time. <gasps> I'm not going to do that for you. <laughs> been searching for me for so long. Only the mics so are crackling. Come. But wait, it's not me you seek, is it? No, it's the girl. I should be offended. But how can I be? You're not the only person who wants her power. There is another, one far more deserving. One who can offer rewards you could never imagine. So sorry, but you've been outbid. <gasps> Fear radiates from you. It's beautiful, but not yet finished. I am Stefano, and now you are my art. My own? Hey, free, Sebastian! Son of a bitch! Whew. We've heard her name a couple times in the game. We've seen it a couple times in chat. Ladies and gentlemen, the beautiful, the bold, my the magical, obscura. Obscura. That thing is stopping me. We gotta stop activating. There she is. She likes to crawl Oops, if I could hit her, that'd be great. I got it going. I just have to hold it off until the emitter starts. 80 seconds. So one thing we haven't really shown off too is there is, yeah, there's a cover system in the game now too that allows you to snap to anything. Oh. 70 seconds. Gotta hold her off. The, the death animation for her might be one of the most brutal in the game. Should I do it? Chat, should we do it? Should we do it, chat? Should we just should we just stand here and see what it looks like? Uh oh. Do it. Do it. Alright, well she's gotta hit me a bunch. Yeah, alright, here we go. This one's for you, chat! This is for Twitch chat! Boom! Say cheese! <laughs> you know what I just thought of? Remember we were talking about goosebumps? Say cheese and die! <laughs> goosebumps. A little throwback. That thing is right. in the emitter. Now let's actually kill it. I got mine. Let's reload the gun this time. Just have to hold it off until the emitter starts. Actually, 
no How gun use it? at all. The bolt that you upgrade, or the crossbow yeah. you upgraded? Yeah, so the crossbow, because we ended up killing, ended up killing the guardian so quickly. I re miked so let me know if my voice is still crackly. Could just be me having a cold. Where'd you go? Nicely done. Right? Oh, look at the way she gets up. It's like... 50 seconds. If it's us talking, then we'll just keep talking at a minimal. Yeah, we just talk like it. No, don't take a picture! Oh, I almost had it. You were so close. Really? Kill us, is this a crack one? the audio board. Yeah. I have an amazing idea how to end this stream. Okay. An amazing idea. Do you, do you know what I'm thinking? No. Shit. I have no idea. Maybe I'll get a signal outside. All right. I'm going to reload the game. Okay. Do it in Nightmare? No. I'm going to reload the game. We'll give away a cat now. Yeah. Uh, I'll do what I was going to talk about. I'm going to show off something else, and then we'll give away the console. Show off the gallery. Don't show off the gallery. No, it's too good. It's too good. All right. I was gonna show you guys something awesome, just as it's too good. It's so too you'll have good. you'll have to find it yourself. But in the meantime, we'll so give away a cat. To make up for the crackling and that we were just gonna give away anyway, we have a save kitty left. Yep. Wow. Who's gonna dance to the light? And then. We'll wander around this office a little bit. Oh, did, what about, do we see the slide projector? Or is yeah, there? there's the slide in there. We can also do some of the other upgrades because we didn't look at all of them. Okay. Yeah. Because we need to stay away from all the spoilers. I right? know, I know. Okay. Yeah, for the kitty. Winner of a kitty. And then we'll play this. Sicknicks. Sick, sick, get sick nicks. Sick Nicks? Sick Nicks. We're just going to go with that. Are you down with the Sick Nicks? Yes. Get up, get up. Get down with the Sick Nicks. You want a cat and a comet. We'll contact you after the stream. 
Do you want to ask your trivia question? Since we have to wrap up here and get ready for the weekend. Do we? Do you? Yeah. All right. Well, let's play this. Okay. And we can All explain this system. Projector. Yeah. And then we'll do that. Okay. So we mentioned before that you're in this world. Well, you're sent in by yourself, but there's some other people to talk to. But Kidman, Julie Kidman, makes a return from the first game. Um, so your line of communication with her is just uh, that communicator that you have, and she gives you some tidbits and some lore about the world, about your background. So slides are collectible inside the game that when you find them, you can sit down and view them from like parts of Sebastian's life, and you uh, talk to Kidman about them. So we'll talk about it from Kidman, and then we're going to give that away. Yeah. Or not. I don't know why I won't play. Let's try one more time. Pre-build version of the game. Yeah. Let's try one more time. Maybe you already looked at it. You can still replay it. It's there. Yeah, I don't know. Okay. All right. Well then, then besides the besides the question. haunting audio and besides that not playing for some reason. All it's right. Horror after it's all. horror after all, right? We're almost there. Okay. What are you thinking about? Lily. Everything that's happening in here is because of her. She's still a sweet little girl. I hope so. She's the real victim here. Something terrible to her. 